Welcome to the DIY3DTech.com channel. Welcome to this edition of uh, DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Uh, I figured I'd share with you a bit of a workshop project here, if you would. So basically, this is my workbench for my microcontroller uh, projects. Mainly, most of the stuff here is where I develop code, you know, kind of test out code, debug it, that kind of stuff. Um, I do very little soldering here. Most of that, I have uh, electronics workshop that, that I do that, but this is where I test things. So I've got, uh, over here, I've got a quad-core PC. Um, and then connected to that, I have a spectrum, a spectrum analyzer, an oscilloscope, and then obviously a monitor which connects to that. And then sort of ancillary tools and um, other pieces. You can see some of the camera, camera slider stuff and Arduino stuff over there that I've kind of piled up that I'm uh, working on because I to kind of clear off the bench. Uh, basically, the bench itself, I've, I've got two... Um, sawhorses from Ikea, the two white sawhorses down here at the bottom. Uh, and then on top of it, I got a two foot by eight foot sheet of mail line and then laid that across. In the back, there's a piece of aluminum channel which holds it square that's uh, glued and screwed onto the back so you can't see it, but it, it hold, makes the, the top rigid. Um, the top is also screwed or bolted onto the stanchions of the sawhorses. So that also holds it straight. And then in the back, there is also a piece of 1 by 4 and there's a gap about 2 inches for the wires. You see the wires kind of coming up through the back from the underneath. And then I've got a 4-foot power strip across the back. So I have uh, plenty of room to plug things into, etc. Then magnifying glass with light because um, the old eyes aren't getting any younger. So and I got storage down below. So it's been a good combination, and I think off to the side, you can see I've got the whiteboard. Um, then off to the other side, I've just got kind of an open wall with pictures of the, uh, or covers of the books, some of the books I've written and that kind of stuff. Uh, however, I want to redo this, and one of the things that I'm, I want to do is, uh, since, since I do some experimentation with audio equipment and that kind of stuff, and that's what the spectrum analyzer and oscilloscope is for, uh, what I want to do is put up, a 50 inch monitor yes you heard that correct so uh, we're going to mount a 50 inch monitor on the back we're going to feed the uh, quad core into it and then so everything we do we'll be able to have on a 50 inch and, and i'm also hoping that makes it a little bit better for doing youtube videos because i don't really want to switch back and forth between screens but i'd like to set up a camera um, to kind of see everything and what i'm hoping with the uh, 50 inch that i can blow things up big enough where you can kind of get a perspective of the whole piece. So I thought it'd be nice to kind of do a little bit of a workshop video. I'm going to do a couple more of these, I think, um, especially in, in, in the actual workshop area, which is um, in another section, because uh, I'm going to do a, a bed leveler for the, uh, the Da Vinci and a couple other things. So anyways, I'm going to get to work. I kind of wanted to show you the before before I start tackling this, because i got to clean this all off and move it and that kind of stuff. And then we'll come back in a little bit, hour or so, when I get this done, hopefully, and we'll see what it looks like. Cheers.